How High Blood Sugar Shortens Your Life, Part 3, Alzheimer's Disease. Hi, I'm Dr. James Machino. There's a great deal of evidence that high blood sugar is a major contributing factor to the high incidence of Alzheimer's disease that we see in our society today. It's not the only factor that leads to Alzheimer's disease. But in a society where we're having more people who are overweight with high blood sugar levels, it's becoming an increasingly important factor that's predisposing us to Alzheimer's disease as we get older. So how do we know that high blood sugar causes Alzheimer's disease? Well, individuals with type 2 diabetes have twice the risk of developing Alzheimer's disease as non-diabetics. Insulin-dependent diabetics have four times the risk. So why do they have this increased risk? Why is high blood sugar a factor? Well, in the, there's an enzyme in the brain that breaks down both insulin and the amyloid plaque. So when your blood sugar is higher, you tend to secrete more insulin. So if the enzyme now it has to be a little bit busier breaking down insulin, it allows the amyloid plaque to build up. Well, amyloid plaque is the hallmark feature in Alzheimer's disease. It's this abnormal protein that starts to strangle brain cells from the outside in. So your body gets so busy breaking down insulin that the enzyme doesn't have time to break down the amyloid plaque, so the amyloid plaque builds up. You understanding this? and it basically strangles the nerve cells from the outside in. The other thing is that blood high blood sugar increases brain inflammation, that's seen in Alzheimer's disease, and it creates brain insulin resistance, so the brain cells can't use blood sugar normally, that puts them into a real funk. So th there's a little bit more to the story. What I'd like you to do is to click on the link below, you can read my short little review article on this. Really get clear on the details because what we're seeing is that a high fasting blood glucose level itself is linked to an increased risk of Alzheimer's disease. Here's the good news. Only 2% of all Alzheimer's disease is linked to genetic inheritance. That means 98% of people that develop Alzheimer's disease, it's lifestyle related. And, and the aging process is a factor, but people with certain dietary and lifestyle behaviors seem to be much less prone to developing Alzheimer's disease. That message isn't getting across. So blood sugar is part of the story. I want you to read my short review article so you know what you're doing. So click on the link, read it now. Now at machinohealth.com you'll see my other research review papers. You'll see footage from my live professional seminars, other downloads and resources and videos I've created. They're all there to help you lead a long, healthy, functional life. My research review papers and teaching materials are complete with all the scientific references. So you see you're getting only evidence-based information from me on any health topic you're looking for. So you should use MachinoHealth.com as an ongoing, reliable resource of health and wellness information for both you and your family. Thanks so much for watching.